This module will cover installing an HP print driver using HP Easy Admin in Mac OS. The first thing we'll need to do is download HP Easy Admin. This can be done through the product support page under utilities and tools and the basic drivers section. Once downloaded, we'll need to decompress the file and then launch HP Easy Admin. HP Easy Admin is a tool that was specifically designed for large enterprise or education environments where one might need to download the driver without being connected to the device. So the first thing you'll do is enter the name of the device that you wish to download a driver for. Uh, the software will go find the, the print driver and then give you a download option. We'll download the software to the downloads folder on the client. Once it's downloaded, there's an easy link to show and find it. It'll bring you right to the package that was downloaded. For this demonstration, we'll go ahead and install the package directly on the client by double clicking on the package and walking through the install screens. The install will require administrator privileges. The package can be used for uh, direct client install as we see here or through uh, remote deployment or scripting uh, using Apple Remote Desktop or any other MDM tools that you may use to deploy drivers. Depending on the package that was installed and the system that it's running on, the install can take upwards of five minutes uh, to complete. But once it's complete, go ahead and click close on the installer. And we're gonna keep it to in case you need to use it for future deployment. Next, we will go ahead and create a print queue on the Macintosh that connects to a Windows printer share. First, we'll select the domain and then the print server and then the printer queue. We'll have to manually select the driver because the Macintosh is not able to communicate directly with the printer to determine the software that needs to be installed. In this case, it's an M527 that we'll be connecting to. Select Add, and it's gonna bring up a configuration screen. This is to add any options. Since the OS can't talk directly to the printer, it can't auto-configure the options. And there we have our queue. Here we'll go ahead and add a print queue using the Bonjour Discovery Protocol that's part of macOS. We'll select the 527 on the network. It'll show directly. Secure AirPrint will be the default connectivity method, so we'll have to change it to the HP driver if that's what we want to add. And then we'll select Add. It will auto-configure and create the queue. For this last queue, we'll go ahead and create a printer using the IP address connecting over IPP. We'll select, um, enter the address in the address field, it will go ahead and use IPP as our default protocol. It should auto find the driver because we're talking directly to the printer. We'll click add. Auto configure will still take place over IPP and the queue will be created. The options and supply tab located in uh, printers and scanners when you select the device will allow you to manually configure the options, look at supply levels and link to any utility or the printer web page. There is a knowledge base article covering the use of HP Easy Admin on the HP Support website, support.hp.com.